guys and welcome back to Thick Chick Thrifts honey where you come for the fashion but I hope you stay for the love hey y'all I missed y'all it's been a really really cool week a really fun week for me my mom was here and we were th the thrift queen y'all and we were thrifting like some crazy people we was going from store to store to store she was here it was like let's hit as many stores as we can hit while i'm here i'll sleep when i go yeah. home so we had a blast i love you mama but i wanted to show you guys everything that we found or i found this week honey because she took her stuff home with her so i wanted to show you some of the cool finds that i picked up this week so let's get it cracking y'all let's go okay you guys so before i go any further i know you're looking at the new dude this is a new wig that i well it's not new it's a wig that i try and i throw on every spring honey bringing in some color bringing in some oh uh, let's get this cold winter air out of here honey pep it up and this is what i was feeling this week so i hope you guys like it it's an oldie but a goodie for me i love it it's just something simple you just keep it straight and you keep it moving honey but before i go any further let me just say if you've never seen me before if you, this is your first time here honey i love you i thank you so much for stopping by make sure you hit that like button before you leave this video and you subscribe honey just so i can tell you i love you and i hope you are having a wonderful day to all my wonderful subscribers honey y'all know i love you you know i do you know i do yes you know i do i hope you guys had a spectacular week you guys are so awesome when i read your comments it is just so fun and cool to keep up with you guys and to you know go back and forth and communicate with you guys so make sure you leave me a comment in the bottom because i love you and i love your comments i pray over you guys and i hope you have a marvelous week this week so with all that being said let's get into this haul honey because it's a lot it's hot but it's good i hope you guys enjoy this one because i did okay you guys so for today my outfit for today is a thrifted piece or a thrifted set you've seen these jeans before in a previous haul i'll try to link the video that i did find them they are a pair of spanx yes honey spanx jeans i didn't even know they made spanx jeans i just happened to be in a thrift store digging honey and came across these awesome awesome i think this is the best pair of jeans or jeggings i should say that i've ever ever found and i think i paid maybe four dollars 398 for them but they have the most incredible snapback of cinch honey that is just incredible and this particular chicago bulls um i would call it a it's not a quite a onesie or it looks like a swimsuit kind of that leotard um it was only 398 so i just threw these on with some jays because you know about me i try to keep it comfortable i got that comfortable sheet that tomboy sheet this is just me and i wore this because my first piece i wanted to show you is this bomber jacket that i found and it is incredible it is a simple leather bomber jacket i'm always on the hunt for bomber jackets because with my height i don't look because like it be fitting like they're too long long bomber jackets or long jackets don't suit me well because i'm only five three so they swallow me up when i wear a long jacket or a long garment um unless it's really flowy and really soft then it makes it more feminine but i try to look for bomber jackets and this one is called well, the brand is called New Look, and it was only $6.98, and you can't beat that for a leather jacket. And the inside, 
looks really, really warm. So I just wanted to have something that way on those simple days when I don't feel like getting dressed up, <clears throat> I can just throw this on with a simple shirt like this and a simple pair of pants like this. And honey, you roll them sleeves up like the fawns and get it cracking and just be as comfortable, especially on a day like this. Like right now today, it's about 50 in the 50s. So a jacket like this is not very heavy. It's not that um, really weighed down leather. You can tell it's that really thin pebbled leather. It's really simple. So I got that for purposes like this when I just want to throw on a pair of jeggings and a t-shirt and be on my way. And I know that it is the season is changing, but you, when you find pieces like this, you get them anyway, and you just stash them in the back of the closet, honey, because when are coming back, whether you like it or not. <laughs> so you might as well be ready. So I chose to get, get something like this because how simple you just throw this on and you're ready to go, honey. But I hope you guys like this piece. I'm going to hang this up for now because it. Of course, it is warm in the house, so I'm not going to wear it throughout the entire video. But I wanted to show you guys this really, really cute bomber jacket. It is a size 1X. And it's, like I said, it's not heavy at all. Very thin. So it's going to keep me warm, but at the same time, I will be comfortable. So on to our next piece. I hope you guys like my outfit of the day. All in all, I think the whole outfit together was less than 15 bucks for the shirt, the pants, and the jacket. Come on, y'all. Come on. I hope you like it, though. Okay, you guys. So, I know this video is going to be like jumping all over the place, but I have so much to show you. I want to make sure I get it all in. But if you have any questions, make sure you leave me a comment down below and I'll answer any question you have. If I happen to be going a little bit too fast. Of course, you've seen these glasses before, you guys. These just are a pair of uh, beauty supply store glasses that I found. Or I could have thrifted. These are an older pair of glasses, cat eyes, that I love. But I'm going to take them off because I want to show you um, my next piece. So I was just in one of the thrift stores with my mom. and. I'm always looking for something very comfortable to wear. And honey, when I came across this, I could not believe what I saw. It is just a simple romper that I I just thought this was so comfortable looking. And I don't care if I wear this in the house or if I dress this up and throw a nice blazer on with a pair of sandals this summer. Wherever I go in this, honey, I know I'm going to be comfortable. I am going to try to style this up so you can see that you can dress something like this up. You could definitely throw on a pair of sneakers with something like this. But I love the pattern. I thought the pattern was and the, the colors were really, really springy and summery. So I got this, but I got it more so for the comfort. It is a pair of pants. It's a jumpsuit or a jumper or romper. And the only thing I don't like is there are no pockets, but I'll just wear either a jean jacket on the top. And of course, jean jackets have pockets in them. So I probably just style this up with a simple jean jacket and just a simple pair of sandals and go on about my business. But I thought this was so cute. And I hope you guys like the way I styled it up because I tried to just keep it simple. You don't have to be like jazzy everywhere you go, honey. There's a time and a place for everything. So just depending on where you're going, that determines how you're going to judge this up. So I hope you guys like this piece. Let's see the tag. Did I take the tag off? Oh no, this was a Goodwill purchase. I can always tell because Goodwill has these little bobbins that they put on their particular things. And of course, you know, I always look for the color of the day. This was $6.99. But because it was the color of the day, which was orange, it was only $3. So, of course, it's 50% off of the Goodwill if you have the color of the day where you live. So, it's called Ivory, Ivory Road. But I love this piece. I hope you guys enjoyed this piece. Let's get to our next piece. Okay, you guys. So, like I said, a lot of the pieces came from either a Goodwill a Salvation Army or 
a DAV thrift. Now that first piece came from a Goodwill. My next piece did not. My next piece came from a Salvation Army, honey. And I don't know who wore this dress before me, but honey, I know she was wearing it because, well, she took good care of it. But this dress is for you to wear, honey. And I'm talking about wear. I don't know where I'm going to wear it, but I'm going to figure out something because it is summery. But at the same time, you can wear this any time of the year. Look at the shape on this dress, y'all. It is that hourglass figure, and it has like that fish or uh, what do you call it, mermaid style at the bottom. But it it is definitely curved for me. A, a perfect. I could not believe when I saw this, and I don't wear a lot of sleeveless things, but I always find things like this because. If I want to wear this out, I have a blazer to show you. I could definitely throw this blazer over it because there is some navy blue inside of that blazer. So I could definitely dress it up and throw a blazer over it. Or, like I said, you can throw on a simple jean jacket and bring it down with a pair of really, really cute Converse sneakers or a pair of sneakers and turn this into something really really casual and cute but i love this i hope you guys enjoyed this it is wow didn't even realize it but it is a fashion nova dress i should have known it was for one of the girls honey yes one of the girls but this is a fashion nova dress and this dress was because the tag is still on it this was 3.99 and huh, what you can't even get that on Fashion Nova for three ninety nine, honey. So I thought this was a beautiful dress, and I just think that a pool party, a barbecue, just depending on where you're going, a date night, this is gonna be on point, and I cannot wait to try this on. So let me know what you think at the bottom. Where would you wear this to? Give me some ideas of where I can wear this dress to, honey, because it's going somewhere besides the grocery store so give me give your girl some ideas honey because all i really do is work and go to the grocery store but i'm gonna find somewhere to wear this dress all right y'all so let's get to our next piece okay you guys so i hope i'm not going too fast but i don't know why but for some reason while i was thrifting that whole co this whole color experience was going on this blue with the flowers or just navy blue was really really prevalent with me this week so i happened to be at another goodwill and i spotted this particular romper and it's a pair of shorts it's really really flowy it's really really soft now the v-neck here is really really low so i probably will put like a pin or something here to keep it modest you can wear a tank kini or one of those little bralettes underneath if you want to to feel more comfortable um with this particular outfit now this outfit was once again 6.99 but it was 50 percent off so it was only three dollars but i really really like this piece i thought it was really really cute they do have the belt to it so i hope you you enjoy i'm just going to throw it on with a simple pair of sandals um you don't want to you could definitely wear this with a pair of white converse if you want to dress this down but i just thought the colors look at those colors those colors are beautiful so i just got this it's something about that navy blue that was just pulling me this week i'm not sure where it was but all of these colors were just kind of like gelling and meshing together. And it was from store to store, honey. So I just went with it, girl. Sometimes you got to let the thrift store tell you what you're looking for. And it just so happened that these kept popping out. But I thought this was so cute. And the flow of this. Now, this came from a CHKD, which is a thrift store connected to the children's hospital. So everything you buy, they donate the money to the children of the hospital so all the proceeds go to the children's hospital besides paying the workers but i think this is such a blessing like when you when you when you do thrift that is why my main reason for thrifting i love thrifting because i know it's giving back but at the same time honey i am getting what i'm supposed to get honey 
but I love this. I thought this was so cute and you can definitely wear this without the belt, but to cinch it in, I would wear the belt to pull it in or to cinch your waist in, but I thought this was so cute and I hope you guys are enjoying the way I style this particular piece. It's really, really cute. But let's get to our next piece, y'all. Okay, you guys, so as I said, I just, as me and my mom were just going like from thrift store to thrift store, hey, we was getting it in. We were having a grand old time. I just happened to go to one of the DAV thrift stores, which is the military thrift store here on General Booth. And I happened to run past this particular romper here. In the summer, I love a romper because you don't have to worry about top or bottom, honey. It's just one piece, one set. Throw you some good jewelry on and a nice pair of sneakers and you are ready, honey. And this one I thought was so, so cute because it had that old 50s pinup style where you tie it behind your neck and your back is out. But at the same time, there's a little belt here because it is a pair of shorts. Now, the other pair did not have pockets. I didn't get to tell you, but that one does not have a, a pockets on it. But this one does. And I thought this one was so cute because there's a lot of stretch in this one. Now, the material is different. This is more of a polyester. That one is more of a polyester. This has a little more of a, a cotton polyester blend, so it's not as, like, stretchy. There's no really more spandex in that one, but this one has a lot of stretch in it, but it had pockets, y'all, and y'all know I love me a good pocket, but I could not get past the polka dots. Look at that green polka dot. I thought that green was really, really pretty. Honey, can it read? Ah, y'all! But I love, love, love green right now. I'm really, I think this summer is going to be like my color, blues and greens. I don't care if it's polka dots, flowers, but something with the blues and greens. So I got this one. And like I said, it went from $6.98 to $3.98. And then it went down. Can you see that? There we go. It went down to $1.98. So this particular romper was only $2. And like I said, there is a belt to cinch you in or you can tie and you can tie it however you see fit. But I thought this was really, really cute. So I'll probably just throw this on either with a pair of sandals or, like I said, a pair of white chucks and keep it moving, depending on where you're going. And like I said, if you don't like your arms out, you could definitely put on a white button down shirt with this. I have many, many white button down shirts. So you can either put a white button down shirt or you can put a jean jacket. It just depends on where you're going and what shoes you're going to match it with but i definitely would do um a white button down shirt you know just to throw over your arms to make you comfortable but it's all up to you girl whatever you see fit that's what you do boo boo but i love this romper and i hope you guys enjoy it too let me know in the comments so far which piece has been your favorite but we got a couple more left y'all so let's go let's see the rest of these pieces Okay, you guys, so listen, I have some accessories that I want to show you, but I have a couple more pieces that I want to run through before I get to the accessories. Now, this next piece was or is, I mean, I don't even know how to explain it, so I'm just going to show it to you so you can see for yourself and I'll kind of like walk you through what it is. <clears throat> I don't know exactly what you would call this. The brand is Ashley Stewart. There's polyester, spandex, and mesh. But I, y'all, it's not a dress. I think it's a shirt. I think it would be classified as a shirt. But look at the beautiful sway on the back of this shirt. I thought this was so up my alley and beautiful. Look at how beautiful that, that is so summery. I just, it was just something happening last week when, when I was out with mom. It's like, it was just all coming together. All of these colors kind of coordinate. So you could definitely mix and match a lot of these pieces. Um, but this took my breath away. This is the back of the shirt. And it's just this fishtail type of thing that is so beautiful. And I love stuff like this. I've done videos before where I've actually taken a dress and just cut the front to make or create something like this. So I 
of course you know, because the size was a size 26 or 28. And for those of you who don't know me, I used to be a size 24, 26. I've been on a weight loss journey for quite a few years and I've been able to keep a lot of the weight off, but I'm still working y'all. God is good. I'm still on my way. Pray for me and I'll pray for you, honey, because them yams and them just is good. So <laughs> pray for me. But I thought even though this was not my size, I could make this a, a dress or put this over a nice skirt. So when I was out, I found this black skirt from Burlington. And I just thought a cute little skirt would go under it. Now I only paid $12 for the skirt, but the only reason why I paid that much was because I do not own a black skirt. Um, and I haven't been able to find one in the thrift store. So I got that to go under something like this. And all I did was cut the sides so I can tie this as tight to make it fit me the way I need it to fit me. So that's a tip for today. If you ever find something that is a little too large for you, of course, you can naturally take it to a tailor. You can have a tailor. I am no seamstress. I ain't got time to be going to no tailor. So I always judge things up or find a way because if it don't work one way, honey, try it another way. So I always cut things on the side to accentuate my hips and my waist. And you can either just tie this up together and you still get that little tail in the back. Or you can tuck this under your bralette or your bra and it becomes like a halter and it'll fit you perfectly. And I hope you can see as I'm styling it exactly what I'm talking about. Because, or you can definitely leave it and just let it drape over whatever you're wearing. A, a girl, a pair of cut off shorts, but I have done, I have beat them in the ground so far. So I'm giving that a break. But a pair of cut off shorts, distress would be so cute under this or a pair of distressed jeans. It just depends on the season that you're wearing this and where you're going. But today I'm just gonna throw it on over a simple black skirt to show you, you know, different ways to wear it because I didn't wanna keep wearing the same cut off style shorts to show you something a little bit different. But I love, love this material and the way they, you know, kinda, it kinda looks like a fishtail or a, mermaid it's just so cute there was just this thing going on honey and i hope you guys are enjoying like this whole like mermaid or or sea connection that's gonna be hap that's happening i really enjoyed it so i hope you guys enjoyed it now this particular dress or shirt was 6.99 it was it was worth it though y'all i can't wait to wear this because there i can wear this in the winter time i can wear this in the fall i'll get so many wears out of this one I, I'm I'm ready to style this one up. So I hope this one comes out the way I see it in my head. Y'all gonna see it at the same time I'm seeing it. So I hope you guys like this one. But I love this piece. I hope, let me know in the bottom if you like this. I just thought it was a cute idea. But we'll see if it all comes together. Now let's get to our last piece, honey. Our last piece and then we'll go on to our accessories. Okay, you guys, so I'm sitting down because I want to be able to show you guys up close and personal the accessories that I found. And first, I'm going to start off with this. Th come on, y'all. This I fell in love with as soon as I saw it. Now, this is really not what I thought it was when I saw it. My initial reaction was, oh, that purse is so cute. So. I grabbed it. It was only $3.98. I'll show you here. There we go. It was only $3.98. But honey, when I opened this purse up, y'all look. Ah! <laughs> look at it. It's the cutest tea set you ever want to see. So I'm going to gift the tea set to the, a little girl in my neighborhood. I'm going to gift her this cute little tea set. It doesn't say the brand. Maybe on the, no, there's no brand. I'm not sure what company this is, but if they're little mermaids on the tea, come on, Jesus. All this, come on. Y'all understand, but 
little fish and mermaids on the tea set. And I think I'm going to gift that to a little girl in my neighborhood, one of the babies that I helped raise in my neighborhood because I used to do daycare. So I'm going to gift that. But honey, I'm keeping this purse. This purse is, or this container, whatever you want to call it, is now going to be my purse. For the summer, you cannot beat this. A lot of the outfits that I showed you earlier have a little splash of purple in it. And if it don't, honey, this is going to be my pop of color. I cannot wait to wear this as a purse. I'm going to get some of that um, statement gold that you can get off of um, Amazon. You know, that really inexpensive purse accessories that you can drape on purses. And I'm going to get a big one and I'm going to drape it across here. Honey, I got, I wanted to show you guys this also. I got this at the thrift store for $3. But I found this beautiful brooch that I think if I put it on here with one of those big chains, I just think that that is going to, I think if I catty corner it, if I put it in the corner and then have one of those huge chains draping off of this, you know, it would tell me nothing, honey. <laughs> All summer, this is going to be my purse for the summer because the inside of this those things can be removed. So I'm going to gift it and put it in a cute little bag and wrap it up in that paper that you can get at the Dollar Tree, you know, that, that birthday paper. And I'm going to wrap up all the tea in the little china set and I'm going to gift it and get a couple of candies and put it in a basket for one of my little girls. And I'm going to gift that to her, but I think I'm going to put this brooch on the side here and have one of those, those beautiful statement. It's faux jewelry and, and if once I get it together, I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. But I love this particular piece and I hope you guys like the brooch idea. I always take brooches and use them to either when I zhuzh my clothes up to kind of hold those together, things like that. Now, my next piece is just, I thought this was so beautiful. That turquoise. I don't know if this is real turquoise or not. I assume that it's not, but girl, who knows? When you're in a thrift store, you don't know what you're finding. But I love the jewelry that's dangling off of it. Those gold accent pieces I thought were really, really cute. And it's that stretchy material. So you're not going to have that pinch because the balls are round. The jewelry beads are round. So it's not going to be scratching you up. I'm not, I've never, uh, I don't have a lot of stretchy jewelry. It's just not my. Thing, but I love this turquoise look it does have a weight to it it's possible that this is real but honey for what I paid for it for two dollars I doubt very seriously but then again who knows I love it though I thought the color was really really cute like that pop of color I don't own a lot of turquoise colored things but I thought this was really really pretty and for two dollars you can't beat it now this particular bracelet I love I love, love, love. Look at that. It's that Cuban. It's that link. And there's a really beautiful clasp on this particular bracelet. Now, I could have taken this because I do own a jewelry making kit and use something like this to drape, but it's not long enough. So I'm going to either use this as an anklet or... I'm going to use this as a bracelet, like whatever, whatever day I need it to be. That's what it's going to be. But I thought something like this was so beautiful. I have a smaller ankle, so I may be able to get away with, you know, if you give it a try, girl, take some of your bracelets and see if they fit on your ankle in the summertime, because it's really cute when you wear um, skirts and I love to see an anklet on it. But this was five dollars. But the, I thought that the color was outstanding. Whoever had this took really good care of it. And it's C-H-O, I think that's C-H-O-N-E-T. You can't really see. It's really, really small written on here. But I love a good gold statement piece of jewelry. And I figure for $5, you can't beat this. This is really, really beautiful. I have a lot of these that I used to put on my phone cases. So this color will last you a very, very long time. Um, but the last piece I wanted to show you guys, I talked about it a little bit in my last video. but I took a simple pair of shoes that I found at the thrift store. Um, 
of course you could definitely wear these and I had the first pair that I took the shoes off of I'll put a clip of the video in I don't wear heels I just love what was on the shoe the decorations on the shoe and I tried to put them on here and I wore it last week but I didn't it didn't give me what I was trying to give so I found these shoes and it went perfect like I cannot explain to you guys like I'm a DIY I'm a crafting girl so when I saw this idea I thought to myself these shoes are really beautiful but plain and I don't do plain very well so when I found these they say forever 21 now, I did get them from Burlington and they were like 9.99 so what I did was took the embellishments off of the last shoe and I put it on this shoe because I am a wedge queen I love a good wedge but this is what I love look at that y'all look and what you do with this part is you just wrap this around your ankle and it is the most honey when I put these shoes on I was like I don't know where I'm going but when y'all tell me in the in the comments where I need to go with that dress, maybe I would wear these shoes with it. But I love this idea. But I just, I'm not a heel girl, but I think that they should start dressing wedges up a little more often. So I figured I would zhuzh them up myself. And I hope you guys like the way I did it. I just took the embellishments off, like I said, the past or the last shoe and put them on this wedge honey and when you tie these around your ankles all of this beautifulness all this luxuriousness just shininess honey is just <laughs> oh, it's it's fabulous and i love it and it's very comfortable because i'm very comfortable in wedges so all i did was got me a good staple gun and some needle and thread honey and created my own custom shoe and it's so comfortable forever 21 i Yes, the cushion in this is extravagant. I love it. It's comfortable. And I hope you guys in really, really in, in, in love with what I did because I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed making it. So let me know in the, in the comments what you think of my shoe, honey. I love them. I hope you love them. So before we go any further, because this is the end, y'all, I hope you liked what I did with this haul. I hope you like the pieces that I found. I know it was all over the place, but it was a lot. So I wanted to make sure I got it all in for you. But I think this is my favorite out of everything that I found. I love my pieces, but I think this is my favorite. And I'm going to get so much wear out of this, honey. I don't know where I'm going, but we're going to find somewhere to go. So before we go any further, y'all know what I'm about to say, y'all. So let me put these shoes up and we're going to get it together, honey. Okay, you guys, see, I, t I knew I was going to forget something. So before I go any further, I found this watch and it has these jewels here. Can you see that? There you go. These jewels encrusted on here. And it's just that square link chain watch. And this was only $3. Can you see that? There we go. See that red at the top? It was only $3. And I could not pass this up. I thought this was so cute. I hope you guys like this last little piece. I knew I was going to forget something, but I really, really love this. And you can wear it with that same link chain um, bracelet. Girl, walk around, people think you got all the monties in the world, but <laughs> you do because you saved because you went thrifting, honey. Yes. Come on, Jesus. So what time is it, y'all? I know you need it, so I'm going to go ahead and give it to you. I love you. I love you. I love you. I thank you so much. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. It was fun, y'all. Me and my moms had a good time. We really, really did. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what your favorite pieces are. If you like this, honey, make sure you hit that like button, honey. You comment and you subscribe to your girl channel, honey, cause we grow in honey like edges. Yes, yes, come on. I love you. I hope you have a wonderful week and I thank you for stopping by Thick Chick Thrifts, y'all. I love y'all, I do. I pray for you. I hope your week is spectacular. You know, if you need me, you know where to find me. 
make sure you leave me a comment because I really enjoy you guys. And I just want you to know I, from the bottom of my heart, I thank you and I love you. Have a wonderful week, you guys. Thick chicks, we just be drifting. Thick chicks, we just be drifting. Thick chicks, we just be drifting. Don't you wanna drift with me?